Hello and welcome to Food for Thought, insights for busy leaders and managers in just 150 seconds. Today I'd like to talk about the secret of success using the 1% rule. There's a great story about David Brailsford and how he transformed the British cycling team's results and performance over a number of years of working with them to just make tiny incremental changes across a very broad range of things. So for example, what they did was they looked at the seat of the saddles of the bicycles. They looked at putting uh, heated shorts on the, on the athletes to help them improve muscle recovery. They looked at the pillows they slept on. They gave them individual nutritional care so that every cyclist was, had a special nutritionist looking after them from their pillows to the biofeedback after a workout to ensure that they were always at optimum performance and making lots of tiny incremental changes. And it's what Brailsford called the aggregation of marginal gains. And in his fantastic book, Atomic Habits, James Clear called it the 1% rule. And I love this because it'll help us to think about how we can just do one little thing differently and improve it by 1% so that over a period of time, actually that compounds. So if you build on that again and again, over 365 days, over a whole year, just making 1% improvements can actually help you get a 37% gain in the results that you can acquire. So think about this. What's the little 1% difference you can make in the communications you have, in the meetings you have, in the clarity of the expectations you're requiring from your people, or the strategic thinking you're doing with your business, and all of the communications you have? How can you be 1% better tomorrow than you were today? And how can you help your team to be 1% better tomorrow than they were today. Because if you can compound that, most people will find it very easy to have a 1% increase. And if you can consistently look for that, consistently bring this mindset to your people, you will make significant changes to the results you can produce. And when it comes to excellence, it's really useful to stay curious. Thank you.